So I wasn't going to post this video, and then a guy responded to my tweet with this, and then I responded with this. Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome back to another Hypixel UHC. I don't know, uh, I'm kind of feeling like playing one, so here we are. We are here to attempt to do my secret plan. Uh, what we are here to do is a strategy I used to do a few years ago, where basically you set up an inescapable trap that takes a, it usually takes a very long time to build. And the goal is you only trap one person. You can trap more than one, but usually the goal is to trap the most stacked person in the game. And then once you trap them, you uh, go and snowball and hopefully win the game. So yeah, I'm not sure this is gonna work, but you know what? We're gonna hope and uh, I hope for the best, I guess. All right, so we should have enough wood for this easily. This trap does not require that much wood. Um, we are going to start running towards zero, zero. Uh, we are going to need some redstone for this trap. So uh, any cave we spot, we shall go down. And that's that. All right, so this is the first cave. Uh, we're not coming back up until we get enough iron, enough coal, and enough redstone. Uh, with the iron pickaxe from tools, we're probably going to be able to make this trap really quickly. Um, but we're still gonna try to trap as little people as possible with it. I think the plan is... So I've tried sitting in the overworld when I do this, and I usually just get traced to. So I think we're gonna build a sky... Or, I think we're gonna go to the nether and hide instead. Oh, that's nice. So yeah, I should 100% have enough iron. Uh, so iron should not be our main focus anymore and we're gonna have two gaps, which is very nice Because um, we can do this and then we can make our two light apples later on in the game So right now we're just gonna be getting a good amount of coal so that we can make a bunch of forges and We are gonna be making um, Some pistons once we get some redstone So yeah, we're not gonna mine any more iron. We're gonna go on the hunt for redstone all right, we can even make a third gap because we decided to find some more gold, so sick. Yeah, um, I haven't found any redstone in an actual cave, so we're just gonna go strip mining and it realistically should take like less than a minute. Oh, there we go. Yeah, pretty quick. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do instead is turn this into an apprentice sword. Um, an apprentice sword does this, which you can pause the video and read. Basically, you get stronger over time. Uh, I feel like if I don't have one, I'm not going to do as much damage as I want to the enemy. So, uh, perfect. On cue, we find more redstone. And yeah, that's enough for the trap. So, we're going to make our stuff and go up. Just to be clear on what I'm making, the rest of my iron, gold packs, um, a apprentice helmet, um, apprentice, or not apprentice armor, iron armor, and one piston. It's been a while. Sorry. Just one piston. Um, we're gonna make some forges. Don't wanna turn all my coal into uh, forges. Uh, we're gonna smelt the rest of this gold and we're gonna smelt two pieces of stone to make a stone pressure plate. Uh, this is very important that it's a stone pressure plate. Um, and I will hopefully, if I remember, explain why later on. Actually, you know what? I'll just explain it now. Um, if you drop an item on a wood, iron, or gold pressure plate, it will activate it. But if you drop an item on a stone pressure plate, it won't activate it. So yeah, I don't want my trap accidentally getting activated by an item, which is why it is made. Um, out of stone. So yeah, the only plan now is to run in and look for a good spot. I'm sorry if you hear some weird background noise. I don't know, where I live is very interesting and there's a lot of uh, random noise. Even at 11 p.m. it is fun. <laughs> this is such a good biome though. For trapping, this is amazing. And I think I have found the absolute perfect spot for this as well which makes me excited i think the hole is gonna be right there uh, i did end up throwing out the shear some uh somewhere along the line so we're gonna get some grass we're gonna get some leaves we're gonna get some extra logs and i'll be back negative 46 west or no it's south south uh 172 
So basically the whole gist of this is that once I'm on the negative 46 cord, I just run south and that's where my trap will be. All right, so let's do this. Just like so, we're gonna go up top and um, expand this by one as well. All right, so we're gonna put some grass around this and then we're gonna dig this down. All right, so we got this all dug down correctly. Um, the next step is to dig three blocks down. Uh, this block, we're gonna dig two in. We're gonna put a piston and a crafting table. This block, we're gonna put wood and then we're gonna put our pressure plate. Uh, we're gonna make this rim wood just in case. I feel like it might be, oh God, that's terrifying. Um, hopefully they don't dig on me. So yeah, we're gonna stay shifted for like two minutes and uh, I'll continue with building this. We have the time, actually they're dying, they're dying. We can, we can build it. Um, so we're gonna dig, we're gonna get some redstone under the pressure plate to be connected to this piston, uh, which we're gonna have to take a little bit of a long way to do this without a repeater. Nope, I did that wrong. There we go. Um, so when they step on this, the crafting table will be pushed into their head. And if I put a forge above them, they will not be able to break, place, or eat anything. So they hopefully should be dead if I can pull it off. And if I can do that on the most stacked player in the game, well, it is very self-explanatory what will happen. So yeah, put the forge in there just fine um we need to make a way up we need to make a way down to here and then we should be good and then we need to find uh the most ideal way to hide which instead of going nether just because it's easier we're gonna take the risk and i think i'm gonna build a sky base the risk about that is if someone a scaffold finds me we're dead that's just as simple as it is we're dead all right so let's get these chests set up um, let's put away my extra sticks and stuff. And so we're going to start by building the way up. And then we're going to build the way down, which is going to be two separate holes just to make everything easier. Or to make everything more hidden. Uh, the way down is going to be at these cords, 46, 185. And the way up is going to be somewhere random that I go decide right now. So without further ado... I think we should get a move on with this before the time ticks away. All right, so the way down, uh, the way up is done. So, or, wait, is that a player? Don't think so. Okay, I think I saw, a, I thought I saw a player. Um, we're gonna go to 46, 185, and uh, we're gonna make the way down. And once this is dug, we're gonna go build the sky base. All right, let's, um, let's go build the sky base, man. There is a clean iron right there, but I do not want to get into any fights. So we are going to go build this. Is that guy a bee hopper? Yes, he is. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm not sure who that is, but we're about to find out. Okay, it's not that guy. I don't think at least. I'm not sure who it is. They just kind of stopped moving. Now we wait, ladies and gentlemen. And now... Uh, we stretch. Wait, he died. He died. Did he die to another bee hopper? I don't know. I'm gonna watchdog him just to be safe. It's just nothing but void. <laughs> okay, that broke my eardrums, but there's 10 minutes till deathmatch. So, it is time to go down. I repeat. It is time to go down. And you know what? We're gonna go down in style. Watch this. So if I shift on the end of a ladder like this and I just fall, let go of shift, look what I can do. Boop. Boop. Boop, boop, boop. Mm, boop, 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 boop. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we're out of ladders. Um, We're just gonna do this for the content. There we go. Like and subscribe if you enjoy. What are the chords? Negative 46, 172. Okay, we're gonna try to remember that. There's a guy right here, actually. They are full iron. Uh, since we have a bit of extra time, we're gonna try to trap them, but...
Preferably, I'd like to find the, f the possible full diamond in the game. He doesn't want to fight. There's a half diamond. Maybe that's why he's running? Negative um, 46. It is the sword reach guy. I would absolutely love to trap this guy. I don't think he's chasing me, though. Huh. Okay, he's going to run away. Uh, I guess we can go look for someone else. Something tells me that that guy's the most stacked guy in the game, though. Even though he doesn't have much armor. He's the one who's, you know, gotten all the kills. Uh, sword reach, and then I can't read that language. That probably means he's cheating. Oh, God. Oh, wait. Three fourths? Diamond? Okay. We're gonna do some interesting things here. Like, I'm gonna try to speed craft a boat. Make myself look a little interesting. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this guy looks... Why is he... Cra <laughs> Why is he crafting a boat? <laughs> Dude, the water is one deep. Why did he make a boat? Someone's on a horse because my arm just did a little thing. There's a full diamond behind me. What? If I can get on top of this tree, I should be pretty safe. But there's a full diamond right there. It's Srimes. I actually know who this guy is from a very long time ago. I haven't spoke to him in a while. Oh, what? What? <laughs> what? What is this guy doing? What? <laughs> what is happening right now? Let's go so tall off guy. He has healing. <laughs> what is this? He's on one hit. Come here. No, wait, no, no. Okay, hit him twice. I need this full diamond. He's running away, but I need him. I need him in my life, dude. Okay, we can ping pong this guy. Don't shoot me, preferably, thanks. Um, hey, East Store, what's up, dude? Okay, so the the plan is hopefully he dies, and then oh no, he's gotten past. I think he's gonna go for me. He might turn on here and try to combo me. Not what I thought he was gonna do. We need to get out of this water before we're dead. Huh, this is not gonna go well. We're, we kind of have to commit to trap uh, this guy. Nope. Like, if you, what I've kind of learned from playing this game is if you run and you get drains, you just, you're just, there's no point. You should just turn around and fight. He's a one hit, so he should realistically die. Which means we are gonna run. And hopefully, we have enough time to bring him to a trap. He has to follow in order for this to work, but it's negative 46, like 170 is all I remember. So I'm gonna, I don't wanna speed bridge because if I speed bridge, he actually might <laughs> suspect that it's me. So uh, we're not gonna do that. Okay, we need to just straight run to this and we will, ha we will definitely have enough time as long as he chases me, which I, I definitely believe that he will. I don't think he has any suspicion that I'm a trapper. Just gotta be careful without uh, taking too much damage here. I might eat a gap. I thought that was a player. That would have e absolutely ruined everything. Okay, we're gonna go this way. All right, we can do this. This is a very natural time to go up this mountain. Okay, 46, which means we get, need to go this way. Right here, right here, right here. Oh, Jesus. Yes! Got him. There we go! We did it! It's over! He can't any healing? Let's go! Yes! Put that on! Exodus! We can win this. Oh my god, my heart is racing. Let's go, dude!
Yes! Oh, I'm dead. I'm, I'm, I can die here. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jesus. Okay, we need to go. Oh my god. Jesus. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Oh, my stomach hurts, dude. Okay. Um, I feel like the only way we can win this is if we can get a bow. But I'm not seeing any sheep. We need to spend these next 30 seconds looking for sheep because if we can get a bow with Exodus, Exodus is a helmet where if you damage a player, you get regen for like five seconds, which will heal you up to one heart. And that is very OP if you have a bow and you're able to just spam someone to death. If we can get a bow, this is looking definitely possible. 100% possible here. Just realized I can make some golden head. Only gonna be able to make one, but that's fine. We can make the second one by doing this. There we go. No, I mean, I mean, we can still make it, I guess. Okay, cool. Let's go. Three gaps, three G heads. He did pearl to the middle, which is unfortunate. What are you doing? I do want these arrows very much. And we need to snag a bow off someone. We can get a bow off someone and especially, oh wait, keep those torches. The torches are perfect. We don't even have to craft them. We can also make another gapple if we get some more. Okay, there's a fight going on. It's uh, this guy's just coming to clean. I'm looking for a bow. I don't- there's nothing in the pile. We're gonna kill this guy, hopefully. If he doesn't run for too long. Please have a bow. Okay, we're cutting him off. If I have the G-head for the speed, I'm not gonna do it. Oh my god. No, no, no! He's on zero! Please! Dude, no! Okay. He didn't, for some reason, notice that I out-juked him there. Uh, no bow. That is incredibly upsetting. Uh, we got some food, though, which we desperately need to eat before we run out of hunger. And we're gonna go look for a bow in one of the piles. That's kind of my only shot here. Throw out the pickaxe. And, uh, bow, please. I will, I will do anything. If I have to fight him and he's cheating, then we, we're definitely gonna lose. If I have to fight him and he's not cheating, we're probably gonna lose, because I feel like he has better stuff. Huh. We're gonna put water down, and we're gonna go in for the hits. I think he's cheating, though. Which means I'm just gonna G-head and go in. You know, I'm pretty positive he's cheating. Yep. Definitely cheating, but nothing we can do. It's a horrible game. Fun. I love Hypixel. This game is so good. Fun. I love Hypixel. This game is so good. Why is there zero loot on the ground anywhere? Huh. Well, we lost because the server is horrible. He said, I'm legit question mark after I messaged him banned LOL. Until the border shrinks, we're gonna be able to survive for a couple more minutes. Hopefully, I don't know, we're probably dead here. 